<laughs> let's just see. Last night we were picking recipes, and I made a really good hot cocoa cookie recipe in the past, but it's got a couple different frostings on top. It's a little more complicated of a recipe, so I was like, Steph, this one looks a lot easier, and it's a five star. We're not sure. We're, if not, we're not sure if it's a five or a four or three or two or one. We're not sure. <laughs> No joke, one of my boys' favorite things about my mom and dad coming are the breakfasts. They just wake up to five-star breakfasts every morning, which they definitely don't get while he's not here. I'm trying to be better, but they just don't taste as good. What do we have on the menu this morning, Pop? Uh, toast, eggs, hash browns, sausage. This is like half the pot. I use both hash browns. I made too many, but they just had me. I'm sure the boys weren't sad that you made too much. Oh, they were happy. This could be... Every day at school this week, they get to wear something oh, for Christmas good. week. On Monday, I wore a Hawaiian shirt, and then yesterday on Tuesday, it was the Grinch. Yep. Somebody's fabulous! Grinch Day. And today... Holiday colors. Holiday colors and Santa hat. <gasps> we gotta go find a Santa hat. Yeah, I'm not wearing one. <laughs> but show them your sweater. We've been wearing this sweater for years. I think this is the one the twins wore originally. We all wore this with our cousins years ago. We were tiny, tiny, tiny. But you can either be naughty or nice. Show them how you can change it. So the question is, which one are you today? So it's the week before Christmas, which means all sorts of awesome programs and parties and festivities and treats and tons of good stuff's happening. I have a sneaky little Santa Claus with me. So today we had Ava's Christmas performance. The whole third grade, fourth grade, fifth grade, they all sang different Christmas songs. Ava, what are the songs you sang? Uh, Polar Express. That time. You did? Yeah. Was I there for that one? Oh, and we wish you a Merry Christmas. With sign language. Is that actual sign language? That was really cool. But the coolest part is that we got to have Papa and Grandma Adams here. It's just been so fun to take them to all the kids stuff because they normally can't come to these things, right? Yeah. But we actually just left a junior high a little bit early. There's an away basketball game today. And as you guys know, Landon is the team manager for his junior high, which he is loving. I don't know anybody who loves basketball more. He's just honestly the best. He sits with the team. He's part of the huddle. We got to ride the bus with them today to an away game. Papa, Grandma, Penny came to hear Ava sing too. Yes. We've got Dad, we've got Ash. Ava and I had to leave a little early because she's got dance tonight. But they're there cheering on our, our team manager, team manager Lando. recipe is called the Jack Adams breakfast. Bacon, scrambled egg, and cheese. Jack Adams is your dad. Jack Adams is my dad. We would make this when we go duck hunting. It was 10 below and we camped in a tent and he would get up and go outside at 4 in the morning and start making this and we'd smell it and all wake up. Wow, now the twins beg for it. Taste it, see if it's good. 
All right, so group number one was Anne, Stephanie, and Landon. They made hot cocoa cookies. It's a recipe we've never tried. <laughs> <laughs> they argued. What is that? <laughs> I can try that. Let's just see. Last night we were picking recipes, and I made a really good hot cocoa cookie recipe in the past, but it's got a couple different frostings on top. It's a little more complicated of a recipe, so I was like, Steph, this one looks a lot easier, and it's a five star. We're not sure. We're, it's not, five stars. we're not sure if it's a five or a four or three or two or one. We're not sure. Yet. <laughs> it might be. It might not be a winning recipe, but you know, you can't win everything. So then we've got group number two, which was Papa and Ava, who's out in the trampoline right now. It's actually really warm outside. It feels like we're in Arizona, but they actually are here in Utah. But we're having Arizona type weather. So they're outside on the trampoline. It's really nice. Papa actually had no idea what he was getting into. Ava picked the hardest recipe, peppermint chocolate. So they made the chocolate cookies and I said, Papa, they have frosting. He goes, what? What? And then he made the fudge frosting. And I said, Papa, they have two frostings. And he goes, what? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So here's the cookies and here, frosting number one and frosting number two. Please vote my cookies are the best. <laughs> Obviously, chocolate, chocolate frosty, and then peppermint on top of that. There's no doubt mine are the best. If you agree, hit the like, hit the bottom. The question is, Steph, do you agree? Um, yes, I'm not does. sure yet. Yes, she does, I'm sure. We taste tested them, and we're not sure yet. <laughs> Group three, Grandma, who's doing the peanut butter Hershey Kisses, and this is a classic. We made this one all growing up. Just getting them out of the oven. Just getting them out of the oven. This is her teammate, who actually really was helpful, despite what it looks like right now. And third teammate was Poppy. She's out on the trampoline right now. She's the cutest little teammate. And last, but certainly not the least, it's team number four. Oh, me and this girl right here. What's your name? Penny. Penny. Penny and Aunt Lindsay. And we're making molasses cookies, which I've never made before. Have you ever made those before? They're gonna be so good. <laughs> All right, we've got the final cookies here. We've got hot cocoa, we've got molasses cookies, we've got peppermint frosted, fudge frosted, chocolate cookies, and then we've got peanut butter blossoms. So we're doing a little taste test. Penny said a prayer this morning that she would win the cookie competition, right? The question is, did you say a prayer? <laughs> so we don't know who's gonna win. We're doing a taste test right now. Justin just joined us for the taste testing part of it. I didn't help make the cookies, but I certainly feel qualified to help try the cookies. How convenient. All right, here we go. Everybody grab one of each one. 